We're at a hotel here in Canary Wharf, and we should have been here for the final press conference between Chris Eubank Jr. and Conor Ben. Unfortunately, we have now been told that the fight has been postponed. Myself, Andy Lodipo, Darren Barker here for the DAZN Boxing Show. Uh, Darren, initial thoughts? Oh, well, look, first and foremost, I'm gutted. Mm. You, you look at the build-up and how exciting it was, and we, we were all just brought into this mega fight. Yeah. And uh, that stemmed from the modern-day fan to the granddads, the dads that watched the, the dads, the fathers fight. And it just crossed over from not just, you know, the boxing fan, but the sports fan. Mm. So, so I'm gutted, but you, you just need to see the outcry on social media. And you have to say the right decision has been made for the integrity of the sport. Yeah, I, I couldn't agree more. I think my first initial thoughts were disappointment. As you say, it's been a fantastic build-up. It really has, um, if you like, the matrimon and zone machine has gone overdrive mm. on this one in terms of how they've sold the fight. I thought Connor and Chris have played their parts well as well. And everyone's just got behind it. So I think mm. initially it is disappointment, but I'm with you completely. I think when you do look at sort of the boxing world, and you know, we're a small world, but we're a tight-knit world. Everyone, I think, is singing from the same hymn sheet here when they say maybe the best thing is to kind of Pause it for now. Yeah. You know, it's not been cancelled. It has been postponed. Pause it for now. Let's just make sure everything is okay. If it is, then we go again. And yeah. I think that's the best decision for boxing. Uh, look, I think as well, you always also have to look at the nature of boxing and you always have to think of worst case scenario. Yeah. You know, work back to front. And uh, if something was to happen, what happens to boxing? Mm. And I, I love this sport. It's my life. Um, so, yeah, it, it's a shame but when you look at everything, the right decision has been made. Yeah, obviously, look, uh, disappointing for the two guys in the main event, but it's also, as you would understand, disappointment for guys on the undercard as well. Mm. Uh, a lot of fighters downstairs that, you know, one day away from weighing in, it's disappointing for them. Hopefully, they can be put on, on other cards, but you almost sometimes forget them in this story. Yeah. They miss out as well. It's, you know, for, for, for different reasons, you know, Shannon Courtney coming back after a while. You've got uh, Felix Cash, Connor Coyle mm. on the cuffs of something really yeah. big. Potentially, you know, the winner goes on to some sort of eliminator, etc. You've got young guys on there. and Galau your fire. Galau your fire. Lindenar for quite a lot uh, of It's fighters. just, yeah, yeah you, you feel for those because, look, this is a sport, but it's a job. Yeah. It's a business and, you know, they've got mouths to feed. So I feel for those. But, look, like you say, when the time's right, Let's hope that this show gets made again. Yeah, and I think that's the, the best way to end it. When the time is right, fingers crossed, we get this event again. Uh, for now, though, unfortunately, the bad news coming out of this is that Conor Ben versus Chris Eubank Jr. has been postponed.